How are we all today? Just want to double check that everything is going out okay. How are we all on this ridiculously warm evening here in the UK? Uh, just wait for the stream to catch up. There we go, there we go. If there is anyone in chat that could let me know how the audio is, that would be much appreciated. Apologies for the uh, summer attire here today. Um, but it is ridiculously warm here in the UK. Summer has certainly and definitely hit. It is insane. I'm not going to go into the spiel about how English, well, British houses, all oh, they're made to keep in the heat, so it's super hot in the summer, and oh, British summer is different from summer everywhere else. But you get the idea. It's uncomfortable. I've got me water ready. I've got the remains of a energy drink. And I am ready to transport myself to the south of France. In particular, to the Dodogne region. And again, if there are ever, at any point, ever, any French-speaking people that ever come across this video, please, please do not kill me for my pronunciation of the words in this game. Of the places in this game. As you can tell by my accent, I am not a native French speaker. And in fact, you know, I should probably check that the audio is uh, actually working out okay on stream. Because that would be embarrassing. It seems to be okay. But again, if anyone does pop into the chat, just let me know how the audio is. Because we wouldn't want to get halfway through a stream without the audio being buggered, would we? That would be bad. But yes. What was I saying? Yes. So, French speaking words in this game. French speaking words. French, just French words in this game. French place names. I am not a Fr native French speaker, as you can tell by my ridiculous and glorious Yorkshire accent. <laughs> I don't think anyone's ever said that before. But yes, I am from the UK. I do not. I'm not a native French speaker. In fact, in the UK, in a British speaking place, this game would not be pronounced as Dodonia. No, no. It would be pronounced as Dodoin. Dodoin. I don't know how. I don't know why. But I'm going to choose to try my utmost, try my very best, to use the French, pr French pronunciation of this game. Because this game was made by French people. This game is entirely about the specific region of France it is named after. Therefore, I think it's wise and respectful to use the actual goddamn name and not the bastardised British version. I think that's fair. Can everybody appreciate that? I think so. But, what is this game? Why, is, why have I called it the most beautiful game ever made? Curious. Curious. Well, you see... Dodonia. And I do have to think every time I say it as to make sure I'm saying the right one, so just bear with. It's a game made by. Made by. Oh my god, I'm, I can't even speak English now, never mind French. It's a game made by um, a, a French dev studio called, and I'm going to try my best not to butcher this, Un Je ne sais quoi. And yes, I did have to put the flourish on because I'm trying to be respectful. Okay. Their background, I believe, is in traditional animation and, as you will see, art. Specifically watercolour. Um, and, yeah, so they've basically set themselves the task of, hmm, video games, art. Let's bring them together and create a interactive, moving watercolour... I don't even know what you would call this, like... It's quite simply, I mean, look, there's there's always going to be the debate of, like, video games, are video games art? I mean, yes, they are. There should be no debate. But, my God, this game needs to be put on a pedestal uh, as to as to the example of a video game as art. You know, every now and then when those um, news articles come out and they're like, oh, video games make people violent. Children of today are, be, are more violent because of video games. Let's be honest. They come out all the time, don't they? I'm literally just going to take this game. I'm going to fizz. I'm going to 
will Dordogne into existence in the physical world. And I'm going to slap the person around the face that says that because this does not make your child violent. Okay. And on that weird tangent, I've just noticed you can't see my mouse. That is not good. How do I change that without breaking... OBS. Now that is a real skill. Did I do it? I do not think I did. <laughs> oh shit. Uh, okay. Oh, never mind. It's all good. We can see it now. Cool. Right. Uh, let me just sort out the audio settings for this. I mean, come on. For God's sake. I said this is the most beautiful game ever made, and look, I'm genuinely happy to have that argument in chat if someone has a different game that they would like to put forward as a, as a beautiful, an artistic game. I mean, before this I would probably say something like Gris, or Gris, as again, I think an English person would pronounce it, but I'm fairly confident it's pronounced Gris. Again, correct me if I'm wrong, probably am. Um, but yeah, I'd probably put that one forward for most beautiful game ever made. But art and beauty is in the eye of the beholder, correct? So you might have a different idea. Let me know. I'd love to talk to you about it. But let's just bump this. Look at this menu, though. Come on, it's it's adorable. More menus should be like scrapbook drawing things, right? Um, obviously a new game. Yes, I'm aware. By the way, I haven't actually played through this game. I just uh, opened it up just to make sure that my my poor my poor adorable uh, laptop can handle handle the uh, the output. Let me know how the audio is um, on the game in chat as well. That would be much appreciated if anybody is watching. And sit back, relax, because trust me, this is worth this is worth watching. Sit back, relax, and pinch yourself every five minutes uh, to remind yourself that yes, you are awake, and yes, this actually is a video game, somehow. I'm not going to speak over this bit because it's... Let the ambiance take you, okay? What is your first memory? Mine... Mine is somewhere in the last few months before my 13th birthday. Whatever happened before... is gone. Forever gone. I don't remember anything. Okay, chapter one, the house. We don't have any memories from our childhood. Interesting. Incidentally, I believe she said that the last thing she can remember was when she was 13. What's the earliest memory you have? Because I don't think it's that old for me. <laughs> Mimi, this dream, again? My head hurts and so does my back. It's probably because you've slept in the back of a car. Is she homeless? Perhaps? Let's find out. Oh, where's my phone? It's in your bag. Must be dad. Open the bag. Oh, oh, I like it. Ooh. Even the phone is like a watercolor. Read the. Oh, this is an old phone as well, so uh, we can maybe assume that this is the early 2000s or late 90s. Messages from Fabrice. Where are you? Your mother is worried sick. Oh. So it's dad, but dad is in our phone as Fabrice. Do we read something into that relationship? Maybe. As if you weren't. 
Do I answer it? Oh. Oh, right. So she's traveling on the road. She's not homeless. It's just a long journey. Right, okay. Uh, not far from Dodonia. I see. I still have to think about it. I'm going to make sure that I pronounce it in the French way as much as possible. And again, if you actually are French or speak French, please forgive me. And please correct me. Almost at the house. Um, I have no idea where we are. So I'm going to say not far from Dodonia. Uh oh, there you go. Do we get a reply? Oh, wow, he's a quick typer. If this is a real dad, the message, the reply will just say, okay, and nothing else. Quickly, for once, let's see what he has to say. What are you hoping to achieve? Oh, okay, so maybe there's some sort of, there's a bit of discourse in, the, uh, in between the family members, right? You know what I want. I want to clear the house out. Hmm. Who lived in the house? They appear. Implies that they have passed on. Nora left me a box. Memories. I need to find out more. Oh. It's an investigation of some description. Um. I need to do this. I need to find answers. I don't want to fight with you. Let's not be confrontational. This is our papa, after all. Not sure what our relationship with them is, but let's just let's just leave that. We need answers, father. You don't come home. Whoa! Whoa, Fabrice, my guy. What's with all the hostility? He'll never understand. He hates, hated Nora. So I assume that Nora is the one whose house it is, and who is unfortunately is no longer with us. But why does Fabrice hate Nora? Maybe we'll find out. Oh, has he sent us another one without a reply? My god, man. It doesn't matter. The removals people are coming on Friday to get rid of all the junk. Do what you want, but you can't change the past. Getting a lot of negativity coming from you, Fabrice. Papa. Hmm, this isn't going to be... Damn right, Mimi. This is not going to be easy. Come on, Mimi. You can do it. Yes, you can, Mimi. Ignore him. Just... He's got his issues, he's got his, he's got his reasons. But let's just... You do you, Mimi. You do you. I should stop answering for now or else I'll keep, he'll keep sending messages until I come home. Yeah, fair. In the same week, I lost my job and my grandmother Nora died. And I got my hands on two letters. That's a really shitty week. Damn. I am so sorry, Mimi. That is not a good week. My condolences. But you can always get a better job as well. You, you got this. You got this. What were in the letters, Mimi? What was in the letters? Oh, do we have to find the letters? Oh, she's crying! I don't know why I didn't think this is, wasn't going to be an emotional tale, but it's going to be an emotional journey, this, everyone. Oh! Oh, okay. Letter number one. Dear Fabrice, I am writing to let you know that in accordance with your mother... Oh, it's his mother! Good God! Wow. I'm writing to let you know that in accordance with your mother's will and your recent phone call, the Dodoin. Did I say that right? Dodoin. No, that was the English way. The Dodonia house will be emptied next week. I would like to f express how deeply sorry I am for your loss. Nora was a friend of mine, and I hope you don't mind me saying, but despite your differences, I know you cared for I know you cared as much for her as she cared for you. Please let my office know if you change your mind regarding the sale of the house. Given the current state of the market, I have no doubt you'll find a buyer before December. But a property like this should stay in the family. Okay. Uh, you will find in this envelope a few words addressed to your daughter. Thank you for giving it to her directly. With my most sincere condolences, Simone... Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm going to try my best, alright? Please don't hate me. Simone Langlois Yao. Notary, Bordeaux, France. Oh, okay. Wait, no, 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 because that implies you stole this letter, which means he didn't give you the other letter, did he? Oh my god. He wasn't going to tell you about your own grandmother's death? I'm not going to lie, Fabrice. We're only getting one side of the story here, but my guy, well, you are not being painted in a good picture. Haha, <laughs> painted. But the other message, that was the biggest surprise. What was the other message? Where is it? I love the, the rain effects, by the way, on the window. No, I want to know. I think I've seen this uh, this service station in France. I think I've been there. 
I don't remember this much rain in France, by the way. I feel like this must be Normandy. <laughs> I love her car. It's adorable. How is this a video game? Dear Mimi, this nope. letter will come as a surprise to you. Because I'm dead? Your father decided to cut ties with me 20 years ago. A choice Why? I understood, but never accepted. This letter is about goodbyes. I will be gone by the time you read it. This is sad. Bellissimo. I've left something for you in my house. A box of memories and a letter. I hope you like to play and explore as much as you did the last time you visited Dordania. 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 Okay, try my best. Dordania. Forever with you, Nora. Well, we're here, it appears. It appears we are at the house in Dordania. Gosh, that, it, it, the animation is genuinely breathtaking. It's so impressive. Oh my god, I agree with your notary. This house should be kept in the family. It's gorgeous. I don't remember this place. I've been here before, but I don't remember anything. I wonder if... Would they hide the key somewhere? We're going to have to find the key. Oh, okay. I actually thought this was going to be point and click. I did not know that there would be a control. So can we interact with the gate? <laughs> I like a little, uh, her little Polaroid picture that flashes up and it changes with her emotions. It's cute. Uh, hang on a second. Sorry. No, ah, did not mean to do that. Right, I can see something in the letterbox. Oh, a key. Someone must have dropped it in there. Oh yeah, I see it. I was like, where's the key? <laughs> All I see is letters. Can I have the letters? Let's empty that letterbox. Let's let's do just that. Oh, it's a cat. Someone's lost their cat. Well, we almost ran over it with our car, so... Found it? Ads. It's a really good... It's That's a really good... Deal if you need a power saw. I think we're good. What is this? We're not going to open that one yet, are we? Oh, we are. Okay. October the 1st, 20, uh, 2002. Sorry, Jesus. I totally misread that date then. To Nora's family. Uh, oh, wow. This So this is like 20 years old. This story is like 20 years old. Okay. I just heard about Nora's passing and I want to share with you my deepest sadness. The whole town shares your pain and we hope you find peace in knowing that in knowing how much good Nora did since since she moved to the region in her the fifties, the mo our most sincere condolences, the mayor Pauline or po Paulin Pauline Prebois, Deputy Mayor Simon. Oh my God, I'm so sorry, French people. Simon <laughs> or Simon Simon Alique Alique. Oh God. Everybody at the town council and the town market. I'm sorry, right, but Nora sounds like an absolutely delightful human being. What is Fabrice's problem? I can't get my fingers through the opening, but the letterbox is loose. I think I can lift it and shake it. What, you can't get your fingers through that? Give me, give me it. <laughs> Damn, the key is stuck at the bottom of the letterbox. Let's see if I can take the back off the let. You could just... I could get my hand in that. Come on. Uh, wait, what am I doing? Rotate what? Oh. Come on. Oh, you come. Right, come on. No, okay. Let's go this way. Oh. Why is this not working? Ah, yes, my trusty screwdriver that I have on me. <laughs> I love this. Oh my god. Thankfully, I had a screwdriver. Do many people keep screwdrivers in their cars? Maybe I'm the 
unusual one here. I love this. They did not need to make that these elements interactive. Like, uh, they really didn't, but... <laughs> I'm a fan. I'm a fan. Got it. Let's grab that key. Again, there was an easier way to do this. Let's be honest. Mr. Key, I will have you. Okay. Make sure you stay hydrated out there if you are going through a heat wave like we are in the UK at the moment. Now I'll be able to open the door. Let's lift this off the gate and push the gate. It's quite intuitive for a, a, what is ostensibly, ostensibly a point and click adventure game, which are usually quite obtuse. Now, to the house. Oh, yep, yeah, yep, sorry, there's actual controls, isn't there? To the house, Mimi. Wow, I'm shaking. I'm not surprised. This is this is an emotional time for you, Mimi. This is... Look, uh, let's simulate her shaking as she puts the key in. Oh, I'm shaking. I'm so nervous. It fits. Oh, that's good. Jesus. Oh. Did, did we do it? So... Push. Push. Here we go. Ooh, determined face. I don't remember anything about this place yet. This house feels like home. Too bad I can't see a thing. Must find some light. Look around the house. Can I use my phone? How advanced is my phone? Can I, does it have a torch feature? It will not have a torch feature, let's be entirely honest. Yes, I know. How do I... There right, we go. Uh, well, there's a, there's, a, there's a candle. Does she have a match in her pocket? She had a random screwdriver a minute ago. So, oh, there's matches there. Wait, uh, the, oh, okay, so do I have to be like... Ah, oh, a candle. Open the matchbox. This is adorable. Uh, lift one up and Hwa! oh nailed that oh, nailing this gameplay oh. key check light check next goal huh uh, the box Nora left me stop talking to yourself Mimi please don't Mimi because then um, I won't ha I'll have to talk to myself so uh, oh a pen wait this pen Um, rotate the pen. Why are we rotating the pen? Is this the pen have some significance to you? Is there something <laughs> in particular I should be looking for? Uh, it's a pen. Remove the cap. Is it a fancy pen? It is, it is a fountain pen. Oh no, it's not the pen we're interested in, it's the cap. Sure. There's a, there's a note. Why is there a note in the cap of a pen? Do you remember this pen? I knew you would find it right away. Yours truly, Nora. I can't say I've ever remembered a pen in my life. My word. I spent a summer writing with this. Writing in my... Diary. No. Wait. I I remember. Oh oh oh. Oh, we're going back in time. Timey wimey stuff. Oh, into the memories. There's the screwdriver. There's the pen. There's the key. And make sure she brushes her teeth. She's always trying to get out of doing it. Fabrice, I know how to bring up a child. Okay. I'm glad she's here with me. We'll have fun, the two of us. Look at her giant head, she's that adorable. That was before we moved to the States. 1982, I think. Oh. We have to go now. Mimi? Mimi! Yes? Say goodbye. Au revoir. No? Are we not gonna... Au revoir, papa. No? didn't say goodbye <laughs> okay so the family lives in the states but are originally French or is she just straight American 
and so is a Gran. So is Nora. Come on. Come on, little Mimi. Come on, let's get your suitcase to your room. Whatever. Okay, I'm an angsty... I don't know, I can't tell children. Is she a teenager? Younger than that, maybe? Oh, she's 13, didn't she? Unpack the suitcase in the upstairs bedroom. I'm... Oh. Jarring. Wait, what, what just happened? There is something here. What? What, what is it? It is a clue. You collected a new sticker. Oh, there's collectibles. Oh, so can we like look at anything? Oh, okay, no. So let's head upstairs and unpack. This is going to be a long summer. You have some respect for your grandma. Oh, there's some. What is? Is there something here? What is this? Oh, I got another sticker. Oh, I'm rolling in the stickers. Up the stairs, young lady. Go and pack. Oh my lord. Wait, which is my bedroom? There is a room here with a do not go enter sign. I wish to enter. Oh no, this is not my room. Bonjour, granny. My room is this one. It is not. Is this one? No, this is the bathroom. You have a washing machine upstairs? Is that, is that a normal French thing? It's locked. Oh, for God's sake, where's our room? Nora, where, where are we sleeping? Oh, wait, was it in that room? Oh, for God's sake. It's here, isn't it? I thought that was, I thought that was my grand's room. Ah, why do I have to do it now? Because you were told. Have some goddamn respect. Uh, I'm trying. Oh, the clasps, I see. Yes, that would make sense. Wow. So. Well, I like our flippy flops. Our toothbrush. Do we have to take them out in particular, or...? Ah, I see. Oh, it's like unpacking. Literally. What? Protect? Wait, protect I've mum. What? Uh, so many sweaters. It's summer, mum. She's so annoying. I'm so angsty. Yeah, let's put our flip flops in this drawer because that's not weird at all. Dad, tiring. Well, let's find out more about dad. Dad really wants me to brush my teeth. What a bastard. Sorry, French. What a. <laughs> What a batard! I have no idea how to speak French. He he was very weird in the car. Let's put these in these this. I think those are trousers, pants, and a top next to our flip flops. Oh, close the drawer. The drawer is full now. Hope, boring. Oh, let's go hope. I hope the summer will pass quick. Oh, that backfired on me. Oh, what, what is that like socks, pants, some sunglasses maybe? I'm not I'm not really sure. Moving away. I wish I could spend it with my friends instead of coming here. I'm not gonna lie, Mimi, I prefer you as an adult. You're an absolute brat at the moment. Oh. Uh can I what close? A letter? What's that? Mum must have popped this in my suitcase. Oh I found a map. A video gave me. A map. That'll be useful if I can get out of the house. Hmm. <laughs> cool. But okay, I better go downstairs. Are you going to take me down? Or are you gonna... uh, is there, are there any secrets? I would like some more stickers. Ah, your friends will still be there after summer, Mimi. Spend some time with your grandma. Like, come on. Don't be rude. Don't be a dick. Is Gram is oh Grandma? Oh, a sticker for me. Oh la la. Um, where are you? 
Oh, what is happening? What am I doing here? Hm. Uh, I don't know. I don't know where your gran is. Grandma! Where are you? Her head is so big. It's fucking adorable. All done. Yeah. Can I go play outside? You know what? Like, I actually kind of relate to this a little bit. Like, I used to spend my summers in France when I was a kid. It's dinner time soon. Ah. Why don't you go... Why don't you draw something? There's paper in the... I used to do that, too, when I was on holiday. Hmm. Oh, she's such a brat, Mimi. Come on. What time... What... When did we say this was? In the eight? Was this the 80s? The 90s? No, because she had a really old phone when she was older. So this must be, like, late 80s, early 90s. I forget. I was trying to figure out, like, if she'd have, like, a Game Boy uh, Advance or something by now. Oh, I've got schoolwork to do. I don't want to do that. I will do I will do my schoolwork like every school child on holiday. On the last day before we go. Wait, who gets schoolwork on, over the summer holidays? <laughs> I wish I'd stayed back in Paris. Oh, so they live in Paris. Before they moved to America. I was not paying attention, by the way, to what I... Aha. This is shiny and glowy. I will pick it up. I will poke at it with my finger. Yay! Oh, yay! That was enthusiastic. You've collected the binder. I couldn't find any peep a peeper. It's now the new word. I couldn't find any papier. So, let's use this old thing. Draw. I'm not seven anymore. <laughs> what should I draw? That's just rude. Like, Mimi, you're a brat so far. I know you're going to go through some stuff as you're older, but right now. Oh, no. Let me actually do the drawing, please. No. No. I want to draw. I want to draw stick figures. And rude things. Parents. Always a safe choice. Mimi, you're 13. I think you've graduated from drawing pictures of your parents. Also, is that your dad or your mum? Oh. That answers that question. It is... Fabrice and Ooh Mama, whose name we don't know yet. You're not a terrible drawer, Mimi. Maybe you have a uh, future in creating um, fan art online. Have you finished? Yes, I have. What? What have you done? This, uh, this isn't I didn't for drawing. Know it. it looked old and. Of course it's old. I've had it since before your dad was born. I, Ooh, it's just no. a, oh, oops. I, Are we crying? This game is playing with my emotions. Oh my god, that looks beautiful. Look at that. Jesus Christ. I'm not up on my watercolour painters, so... I'm sorry. I was going to say, it looks... Almost like a Monet painting or a Van Gogh, but again, I don't know painters, so that could be a completely ignorant reference. I'm sorry, Mimi. Hang on, sorry, did you just leave us crying on the wooden floor until night time? Jesus. Is it tad harsh? Sorry. Listen, silence. No, we apologise, come on. Don't be a dick. We're not a dick. No, no, it's fine, sweetie. You've never shown me that binder before. Is it a secret? I usually lock it up in the attic. Why? Is it a magical binder? Old? I want to know more. Oh, hidden. Oh. I'm going to go hidden. Why do you hide it? Correct answer. It's a memory. It's a lot of memories, actually. Wait, what? Are there photos in this binder? I need to see more. This binder is very important to me. Your grandfather and I, we used to write to each other through these pages. Oh no, oh my god. Oh shit. <laughs> so it's precious. Yes, but maybe... You know what? Why don't you take it? Oh! Nora! Be still my beating heart, you adorable human being. I will not cry on stream. Take it. Why? Because it wasn't meant to... Oh, no! Oh, wow. 
my god, wait, what happened to Grandfather? We used a binder so it would never be over. We could always add pay. This is freaking adorable. Do you understand? I think so. It's like a never-ending book. Or a never-ending story. Promise me you'll keep writing and drawing in it. That you'll keep that you'll keep it alive. Oh god, I was not prepared for such an emotional for such a heart string tugging tail. Would you like me to show you how to use it? Yeah. Oh, we've got a gap in our teeth. First, you can write everything you need to remember to do here. I still do that now. Let's add the map your mother gave you. This way you can't get lost. Bold of you to know to assume that I know how to read a map. We always kept the binder organised, so I'm hoping you'll do the same with the tabs. All the little memories you've collected are tidied and stored in there. Maybe we'll put some new stuff in this binder over the holiday. I'll let you explore it by yourself. How kind of you. So we have done our to-do list. On it. Uh, summary? Oh, is this gallery? Here is a sticker. Oh, okay, these are just... Can I... Oh, so it's almost like... So it's... Maybe I'm t completely barking up the wrong tree here, but is this game almost like, um... Oh, God, what's he called? David Cage's Ones, who is also a French video game. <laughs> um, oh, is he French-Canadian? Maybe French-Canadian. Um, yeah, the game's by um, Quantic Dream, where you, like, choose responses, and that determines the path that the, your gameplay takes and the story therein. So it, re it, it reacts to your choices. Maybe this is like that. Because otherwise, why show us what we've already, what we've chosen? Or give that as that choice in the first place. Very interesting. There are layers to this game that I was not expecting. I'm impressed. No, the memory's over. I miss my grandma. I'm literally going to come off this stream and call my grandmother. Oh, we have a Sony Walkman. Other brands are available. Well, actually, they're not. Hmm. That was chapter one. Damn. Okay. Okay. Chapter two. The river. The binder. I remember it now. Maybe the binder is in the box. The candle won't last forever. Let's open the shutters. Let's do just that. Uh, in here. Into the kitchen, I think this was. Oh, beautiful. Wonderful sunlight. Much better. This place hasn't changed. Oh, there's something on the, on the, table, the table. No, no, no. There is there not. Oh, do we have to? No, it's kitchen. Always spotless. Do we have to open more windows? I can't see what I'm doing. I think I just tried to turn the TV on. Oh no, no, I got it. Love those uh, shutters that are all attached to each other when you open one, they all open. Ah, feels good. Excellent. Pictures of strangers? They're not actually pictures of strangers, are they? You just, I suppose they're strangers to you. Ah, the, 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 the couch, the sofa. I don't think it's called a couch. It does look comfy, though, I'll give you that. Um. Oh, wait. Can we... What's this? Pictures of random people. Are these pi people members of your family? You just don't know them? Oh, the forbidden door. Oh. Maybe she put the binder in my room. After all, she wanted me to find that box. It's good logic. In 20 years. Wow. Damn. I can't see a thing. Let's open the shutters. Letters. Are you going to do it? Did I do something wrong? Seems like an extra long animation to open the shutters. Feels so good. Well, feels good. 
I don't think the box is in here, me, me, my, my old pal. Let's see what's in here. Probably still your flip-flops. Oh my god. Will the flip-flops be in there? <gasps> oh, no. There is a, a cassette tape with some snowflakes on it. This is ancient. Where am I going to find a tape player in 2002? Hey, I said late 90s, early 2000s. On the money. Uh, what is this? Letters. I'd better save them. I don't want the removal people to throw them away. Let's see. Oh, okay. Got some reading to do. Paris, October 11th, 1970. My dear Edouard, this trip to Paris is wearing me out and I miss our home terribly. Yesterday for lunch I saw some colleagues with an, from the agency. Michel says hi. Whenever I hear the word Michel, I just think of the, um, Michel from Gilmore Girls. I met some of the new architects, including a couple of very bright interns. The stench of cigarettes and cold coffee. The crumpled... The crumbled... Crumbled? The crumbled paper sheets. The tables covered in drawings. What a joy... Yeah, I want to read it. What a joy to find, again, these half-forgotten memories. I immediately felt a strange lassitude. I do not know what that word means. And went back to the hotel. I had to be... I had to be rested to meet Helena, Fabrice's new girlfriend. Oh, is Helena our mother? Maybe. Dinner was in a small bistro in Port... Oh, for God's sake. Port Malo? 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 Oster, oster, I can't speak English. Oysters, because I absolutely love them. Helena comes from a very wealthy family, but she is quite nice, if a little uptight. You know me. I couldn't stop teasing her about that. And Fabrice and I started to have one of our little arguments. Oh, oh. If you had been there, you would have found the right words to calm him down. I couldn't, so I lost my temper. Oh, oh shit. Oh. Why do they have such a strained relationship? Time for me to leave. It's quite late, and I would like to sleep before the next leg of my trip. Tomorrow is Nantes. After tomorrow is Kibaron. Kibaron? I will be back. I will be back as planned next week by the 4pm train. Until then, I drop a kiss on your lips. Your Nora. It's freaking adorable. Oh, it is her mum. Okay. Hmm. Late 1970s, she was already pregnant with me. Right. So she was late 1970. That implies Mimi was born 71. It's now 2002. Which means Mimi is 31. Is my maths right there? Oh my god, she's the same age as me. Shit. <laughs> not do that. Um, Mimi does not look 31. That's a compliment for you, Mimi. Okay, enough of that. Let's leave. Let's get back to that drawer. What is it? What? My old, ca an old camera. My old camera. Uh, oh, let us rotate the camera. I'm so sorry, French people. I do not know why I do this. Unfold the flash. I, I'm trying. Nice. Holy shit! This is an old camera. I have never seen a camera like this before. Uh. What is happening? A, f a funeroid 80. Because Polaroid is copyrighted. Wait, wh I do not know how to use this. Shh. Shh. I assume I have to put that at the front, right? No, can we put this back? Oh, we cannot. So. I was going to say that goes in the front, right? Or the back? Oh no, it goes on the right hand side. Uh. Which is the bit that I point at the picture. <laughs> right, that's the front. That's the fronty bit. That's, yeah. And. So I want to take a picture of. Wait, what am I? <laughs> I don't know what I'm meant to do. Do I press this down? I don't know how to use this kind of camera. Uh. I do not know what to do. If I wish, I want to take a picture now, so I'm like, papa. Okay, I legit don't. 
I don't know what to do. Uh, did I do something wrong? It's not giving me any prompts to like... It's just implying, turn it up, turn it around. Like my hand isn't coming up, you know, to signify that there's something I can interact with. Oh! I didn't even realise that that was there. Come along now. And clasp onto this bit. There we go. Apologies for my stupidity. Wait, is that not just taking a picture of me? It's facing me. Oh, we're back, going back into the memories. Timey wimey. Ooh. Mimi, wake up. <laughs> she sleeps like me as well. It's almost nine. Oh my god, 9am. <gasps> Sucker blue. I wonder what's for breakfast. Bre breakfast? Oh my god. I I remember how hard it was the first few days. Far from home. Get ready for the day. There appears to be a star thing over here. I want it. Oh, is it? Wait, what? Uh, oh, it's the wardrobe. But I want to put our flip-flops on that we are keeping in a drawer. Breakfast ready. Right. Time to go down. I'm not going to be rude and... St oh, sunbeam. Wait, no, I want to cl click on sunbeam. No idea what just happened then. Did I, I picked up another collectible. Ah! Grandmama, what is for breakfast? Well, I've collected a new tape. Awesome. Do I have the Walkman yet to play it? Wait, where do I sit? Do I have to walk all the way around? Why? Do you want to drink? What do you usually have at home? Bitter. Sad. These are my options. These are not good options. What are we looking at here? Like, coffee is bitter. I mean, it is. And... Sad lemonade. <laughs> um, I'm not. I want to be bitter. Sad, I guess. Wait. Do, what am I doing with it? Um. <laughs> okay. Well, this. I've made my choice now. I cannot. Oh, I just had to bring it in. Okay. Ow! The juice hurts my teeth. Well, if you listen to your father and brush your goddamn teeth. The juice wouldn't hurt the teeth, would it? It's from a far... Oh, it was apple juice. <laughs> it wasn't weird. Lemon juice. Uh, lemon juice, lemonade. It's from a farm near here. Real apple juice. Hungry? I've made some toast. But I want a croissant. Uh, the, okay, my only option is lost. <laughs> okay. May I have butter on... Oh, alone. Or deep. I'm not alone. I have my grandmother. Stop being a little brat. Let's get some butter on there, and let's butter that toast. Oh, yeah, nice and good. Hmm. The butter looks weird. It's so yellow. What kind of complaint is that? Yeah. <laughs> Why do I relate more to the grandmother than the small, brattish child? Alone again. Or oh, fear. Oh, yeah, let's get... I don't want... Is that a normal thing? Do people normally put honey on their buttered toast? I'm going for the jam, my man. It's all about the jam plan. Get that slathered. It's very bitter. I don't like it. To be fair, if it had bits in it, if it had seeds in it, I'd be there with it. It's good, but it's not very sweet. That's because it doesn't. It isn't full of sugar. I had very... <laughs> I'm sorry, but like, I am absolutely in, in lockstep with the grandmother. I had very little sugar, and the strawberries are from the garden. I'm legit not kidding you. That So, my mum, my mother, lives in France, and I'm not actually kidding you in that she uh, she makes her own jam from, I don't think strawberries. 
but some kind of berries from her garden and walks and stuff like that. This is weird. This is weirdly relatable for me. Can I have some cereal? And yes, I did used to spend my summers there. And I would draw and... Well, to be honest, I'd play a lot of video games. <laughs> um, I bought the cereal for you, but it isn't good. Dreadful ingredients. But, but I like it! <laughs> Your mother insisted. It's full of sugar, Mimi. Really? You can have a little bit. No more. Look, Mimi... Nora, your grandmother is looking out for you. Just be grateful. Take some cereal. Okay. Oh, wait. Wait. Okay. So, here. How do I... Aha. I missed the ball. Oh, no. Let's try that again. No, I want more. This is not going well. I don't even know. What am I eating? They look like um, golden nuggets. Does anyone remember them? Are they still a thing? Yeah. Surely that's too much. Can I just keep doing this forever? <laughs> How much cereal is in this box? I'm just going to do this. I want to see what happens. Legit, I just want to see what happens. This is, this is my angsty way of getting back at my grandmother because I'm a brat. You said I could only have a little bit of cereal, so the box is now empty. Wait, seriously, what do I do? The box is empty. Do I put it back? Do I bring it close to me? Did I did I mess up? What do I do, grandmother? The cereal box is stuck to my hand. Oh shit. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Oh, I was taking a piss. I didn't think I didn't think this game would be this reactive. <laughs> I thought it was like a point and click adventure game. I didn't think it'd be like, you've chosen too much cereal. <laughs> oh, it's fine. The child is crying. I thought I'd I thought I'd made the grandmother cry. Fuck the child, I don't care about this. Are you okay, Mimi? I'm not hungry. <laughs> Sorry. I'm not hungry. With a giant pile of cereal. Oh, I should have probably said the other thing. You know that in here, it's okay to not be okay. That's true. It's good. Good life advice from this grandmother. I hate it here. My friends are all at home. Uh, home. <laughs> um... I feel like I'm being awful to- I mean, I am being awful to my grandma, but I don't exactly have great choices. I'm not going to say that, because that's really mean, and I don't want to upset my grandmother, Nora. Let's go with friends. I want to see my friends. I think that's that's the lesser of three evils, right? That's, that's okay. It's okay to want to miss your friends, right? We're supposed to spend the summer together, sweetie. It's It's unfair. I know you miss your parents. Hmm. And your friends. Yes. Let's go out. Let's let's do something. Just the two of us. What a great idea, grandmother. What a great idea. What do you think? I would like that. Yeah, alright, I'm I'm pretty chuffed with myself. She I think usually if I made a good choice. Or shouted. But she simply she gave me something. I could tell she was forcing herself to be nice. Why? I do not get that impression of your grandmother at all. She seems lovely. She does not seem like... Why is she creeping on someone? What is happening? Grandmama's creeping on you. We would be walking down to the river. She'd be quiet. Lost in her thoughts. My father hated it when I did that. He probably hated his mother too when she was like that. I think your dad is a dick. The pebbles. Cold, cold water. The Dardania. Oh, I love it. The Dardania. You. Oh. Yay. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Awesome! It is so warm here right now. 
and just hearing the trickling of that river, I really, really want to dive in it. And <laughs> it's not even real. The view is gorgeous from the middle of the river, but here, take this. Take what? Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> She's given us a camera! You've collected the camera. Awesome. Oh, a camera! <laughs> it was your grandfather's and now it's yours! <laughs> oh no! <gasps> Okay, I agree with that Polaroid picture of Mimi there. Huh. Look around you. The view is just spectacular. I'll get a picture of them from the... Do, I swear to God, do not fall in this river with that camera, Mimi. Do not ruin this camera. This is a gift. Oh, this is going to end in tears, isn't it? Oh, I'm nervous. Oh, no. Oh, those rocks look slippy. Oh, we have to go to this one. This one should be cool. And this one. I'm nervous. The tension is building. Oh, we made it. All is good. Oh, all right, Mimi. First, you have to focus on your on the your subject. <clears throat> Sorry, there's a lot. <clears throat> there's a lot of dialogue in this uh, game. My throat is getting sore. What are we focusing on, Mimi? Oh, balloons. Oh, but also the reflection is pretty. I'm gonna go for the balloons. Mm. I'm gonna go for the balloons. Only then, only then can you take your picture and voila. Oh, I can't really get the balloons in properly. Okay, so we ignore the balloons and get the reflection. And remember, uh, photography students, your subject should never really be the uh, center of your field. It should be. Sort of. You gotta split it into thirds, right? Is that is that right? Am I remembering my photography right? Okay. Look, we've got company. Why don't you take a few a photo of those hot air balloons up there? I oh okay okay. Let's have a look. Oh, there's oh, there's fucking loads of them, man. Jesus. Oh shit! Uh, right, which one? Which which, pic, which one do we want to take a picture of? That's cute. That's that one's stuck in a tree. Oh, that's the one. Wow, that's a postcard. If I've ever seen one. Well, what's wrong with that? Okay. Oh, that is a good photograph. Good. One last picture before we head home. <laughs> nice. Ooh, ooh. Oh, uh, how about Grandma? Yeah, let's take a picture of Grandma. Oh, Grandma Ma. Okay. Your okay. holidays got off to a bit of a rough start, but I do hope you're feeling better, sweetie. I, yeah. I think today was fucking sick. <laughs> today was fun. Pretty good. Complicated, but no, it was fun. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Let's 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 start being a nice watercolour painting of a child memory. What kind of pictures are you going to take with the camera? River, nature, you. Ooh. Cause the river is pretty. Nature is also pretty. But I also want a relationship with my grandmama. And I think that will make her happy. So let's go with you. Pictures of you! Oh, thank you. But look around you. It's much more beautiful. I disagree, grandmother. I disagree. Respectfully. I tell you what. Why don't we note all your ideas down in the binder? Man, you are getting some amazing life lessons here. Sticker. Po decorate poetry. Uh, sticker? Sure, I can find the right sticker for the back. That sounds good, sweetie. What do you say we put more headings in your binder so you can create some great pages? Okay. Create your own, craft your own page, you. Right. There you go. Here you can create your own page with all the memories with all of the memories you get. When you're happy with your page, and you can move it here, and it will become part of the binder. I don't understand. 
how do you how about creating your first page I'll leave you to it craft my own page um, so oh so is this oh okay I'm with you I'm with you this is like a symbol for stickers maybe this is a symbol for drawing you know or, or writing this will be photos and I'm assuming we'll get we, we've already got tapes right so we just need the Walkman or something let's go photo um, yeah with this one because it's sick today was a good no uh, look at that oh okay, then I can write oh sick that's what the f the words are for so we can write stuff with it so I go like fun I don't want to create a poem is it all poems I just want to write the word fun alright what's this okay and that's the sticker right okay uh, right I'm okay. Fun habits. Sunbeam. What's that? Sunbeam. Soft on my skin. I open my arms towards the sun, recharged by a warm sunbeam. I prefer it when poems rhyme personally, but I must admit it's fun. Momentary joy. Amused by smiles. Hmm. I'm an intellectual 13-year-old, don't you know? Friends, friends, I miss you. I must see my friends again. Erased friendly faces. I feel like she should have like a... One of those long cigarettes that like Cruella de Vil has, you know, on the on the sort of stick, and she's like wafting it around. She's like, like a shiny sticker, I stick and I unstick, illustrated by a dash of colour. No, I gotta use that one by the way. You need two more words to complete the poem. Oh, like a shiny sticker. Oh, and I can choose. The I get to make my own fucking poem, man. Like a shiny sticker. I am discovering my grandmother. Uh, now, uh, like a shiny. Can we? Can I? Can I? No, 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 no. Can I? Ch can I change it? No, I can't. Shit. <laughs> like a shiny sticker, vague but a deep look. I open my arms towards the sun. <laughs> <laughs> no, it does not. No! <sighs> like a shiny sticker, vague but a, but a deep look, I open my arms towards the sun. <laughs> Praise the sun! No, oh, whack it there. And then we'll whack our sticker in. Yeah, of course. Bam. Bam. That looks like a good page to me. Not a fan of the poem. I think I could do better, but we were learning the mechanics. Next time. Next time. This binder was a connection between your grandfather and me. I think he would have loved seeing you use it. I I miss him. So sad. Oh, I do too, my dear. I do too. Ah, <laughs> it's not fair. It's emotional. Ah. Memory completed. Letters from the past, poems, pictures, postcards. Huh? What's that? It's a cat, obviously. What do you think it is? The black cat's crossed your path. Bad luck, right? Oh, it must be Nora's cat. What the fuck? She looks hungry. Yeah, because your grandmother's dead and no one's been feeding her. What's that noise? I'd better check. What? Did... What was the plan for the cat? Oh, I've sent you um some uh, letters you... and memories. P.S. Nobody's feeding my cat. I'll help you. Stay still, little one. It's going to scratch you. That is a great scene. <laughs> Hello, Missy. It's gonna go. Whoa, no, 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 no. <laughs> I wasn't very brave there. I must be hungry. And I need that key. Why does the cat have a key on its collar? What is happening? The market. 
are in front in French Marche. Marsh? Maybe. In the fall, it's a bit damp over here, but in the summer, it's in the shade. Did we do this together with Nora? Of course it's locked. How likely is it that the... Why does the cat have a key around its neck in the first place? That's not a safe security system. I need to be clever. This cat knows this place better than I do. And it's a starving beast because no one's been feeding it. Wait, where is it? Spread the bushes. Oh. There is a gate. I feel like it would have been easier for that cat to jump over it, not to go through it. Like a professional gardener. This place. I remember this place. What a lovely little spot. I spy a hungry little kitty. You're not gonna get it. Well, yeah. Why do you have a shrine to cats? It's just gonna. If I scare her off, she could disappear for days. A bit of food might do the trick. I'm sure Grandma has something for you in her kitchen. Okay. Stay there, kitty. I will f save you from certain starvation. This does the kitchen. Oh, is it? Are they here? Is it this? Manchan. Ah, oh, fishy treats. You've collected sardines. Sardines. Cats love these. Or is that a stereotype? I actually... Don't... Not sure. They are very salty fish-like. Oh. Oh, we have another uh, letter. <clears throat> Dear Nora and Edward. Wait, who's Edward? Is that... Was that a granddad? Shit, I can't remember. I hope you won't mind me sending this let you this letter. Edward and I studied together for years before we parted ways, and I am proud to call myself a friend of your family. As you requested, I met with Fabrice and discussed his military ambitions. Oh, Fabrice was in the military. I was extremely surprised to see how much he has changed over the years from the quiet little boy he was into the complex young man he is now. I mean, com describing someone as complex is a bit of a backhanded compliment, isn't it? Let's be honest. His academic record and results are solid, but I have my doubts that the military school he has applied for is best suited to his current state of mind. May I suggest the Boy Scouts? <laughs> or a place where he can focus on empathy and community. Take care of yourselves. I hope to visit your delightful little house in Dodonia soon. Mark. That's proper shade, that, by the way. Like, I want to be in the military. Have you, uh, have you thought of the Boy Scouts? Because you're a bit shit. Also, this line here. Bollocks, I made it go away. I did not mean to do that. How do I bring it back? Can I? Shit. I didn't mean to do that at all. Oh, we have a... I was going to say, was that letter suggesting that our child... Uh, sorry, Fabrice has no empathy? We have a message. Dom. Who is Dom? Don't push yourself too hard. As your therapist said, you can't save everyone, little hobbit. Why does my therapist have a pet name for me? I like the Lord of the Rings references, though. Oh, are we, are we done now? What is this? Uh, okay. Um, also, I've just seen something over here. Is this more treats? You've collected store-bought treats! Yay! Industrial treats never opened. Nora wouldn't have used these. Oh, so who put them there then? Interesting. Interesting. Well, look, we've got... Oh, what? For real? Okay, can we do something? Well, that's not my fault. 
Oh, well, I didn't know there was a pantry. My first studio flat in Paris was smaller than this pantry. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. Uh, what are these ones? What am I looking at? You've collected homemade treats. Ooh. Homemade cat food. That's just like Nora, but it smells weird. Yes, because it's probably gone off. I should have enough treats for the cat. I need to get back to the pond. Are we trying to feed this cat or poison it? What is happening? I am a 31 year old woman that cannot navigate a table. I hope the cat's still hungry. I hope the cat's still in the same place. Not exactly known for their, uh... Oh, look, it's gone now. You daft idiot. Oh. How incorrect of me. Hello, you! Ooh, do we only get one chance? Well, let's not go for the home... Let's not go for the shop-bought treats. They've never been opened. Nora would never use them, so why would the cat respond to it? Homemade treats probably does respond to it. Smell weird. Don't want to kill the cat. That would be really devastating. So let's go with the dried sardines. It's a stereotype, but maybe that's for a reason. <laughs> Can I hit it on the head with them? Oh, I can't. Whoop. Here, cat. Here's a fish. Damn it. Okay. Well, I. I want, logic dictates the homemade treats, but I don't want to kill it. A cat of great taste, I see. And watch it, like, chop. It's going to throw up now, isn't it? Here, kitty, kitty. Mmm, tastes like food poisoning, no? Come to me, my pretty. What did you do? What did I do? Oh, right. I have to wait for it to finish the treat. Like no pet ever. It will not respond if it is still eating. Every pet I've ever had would have bitten my hand off for these treats. Even if they are out of date and stink. Whoop. Grab it! <laughs> Oh, kitty's purring. We successfully got the key. Yeah. It's time to open this cave. What an unusual phrase and sentence you have just said. To the cave! Oh my god, is your grandma... Oh my god, what if your grandmother was Batman? I hope the key fits. Well, where else do you think it's going to go? Oh, yeah. oh, so nervous. Oh, no. What if the key doesn't fit? Oh, no. Woo. Where's my hand? There it is. Pull. Pull. Oh, no. Push. Everyone's made that uh, mistake before, right? Yes, I'm in. Oh my god, it actually looks like a hobbit hole. What? No! God damn it. It actually looks like... Oh, there's a note. I see a note. And... This is cool. I want a cave in my garden. I want the goddamn notes. what I want. Who are these people? Who is Romaine? Once again, I would like to apologise for what happened with your boy. We usually try to stay out of the playground when it comes to problems between students, but things escalated and we felt it was the right move. I don't believe your son stole anything, and despite the rumours, it was me who gave him the watch. Other parents have been quick to use this as a way to criticise your son and your family. Oh, good God, what is happening in this game? What is this story? Oh, Edward again. I also need to apologise on behalf of my wife. Nora has been very protective of me lately. Mostly because of my health, you must have heard. I'll talk to her son. Trust me when I say that she will believe your child and me. We love him very much, no matter what you might think at the moment. Oh my god, right, I'm so confused. So, Nora is... Right, Mimi is the child. 
Nora... No, wait, wait. Mimi is the child. Her parents are Fabrice and Helena. And then Nora is the grandmother. And the granddad's name is Edward? Let me reread that again. Uh, yeah, that, that. Yes, I think that tracks, right? So, Edward is granddad. No idea who Romain is. Apparently, maybe the father of another child. That Fabrice is being a dick to. <laughs> Wait, we've already read these, haven't we? Uh, yes, yes we have. Okay, um, dear Nora and Edward, right, yes, yeah, so, no idea who Mark is. Yeah, right, so Nora and Edward are the grandparents. Cool. Fabrice is a dick. <laughs> uh, yep, yeah, that's a letter from Nora to the grandmother, uh, to the granddad. Uh, Oh, shit, I don't think I read this. When did I pick this one up? Paris, August 28th, 1978. I'm taking the time to write down these few words in the hope that you will be able to forgive your son. After our rushed exit from your house, I couldn't find the opportunity to tell you how sorry I was for the words he used. Fabrice, what is your issue? What has happened? I know that Fabrice and you do not often agree, but I dare... To believe that between a child and their parent there must be a form of respect which should not be broken. I agree. I agree. I also I also think that if you're a dick, then you kinda get what's coming to you, you know? I also believe that this whole scene was not a good show for my little Mimi. Obviously you have the right to see her. I wish for my daughter to have an exciting and meaningful moment to have exciting and meaningful moments with her grandparents. She must grow up knowing she can count on you as much as she can count on us. I would request from you to not disclose this letter or its content to Fabrice. Thank you, your daughter-in-law, Helena. So again, we're still on the Fabrice is a dick train, right? Because I don't know what his issue is. Obviously, we don't know the full story. We're learning it, but initially, Fabrice, you're not coming off great, my boy. Um, yeah, we we already seen this, right? Yeah, I think we already seen. Uh, is that all of them now? Yeah, that's the notary one. Yeah, okay, cool. Right, righty, 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 and this just opens up all the letters again. Okay, right. It's like a like a detective game this there's the kayak <laughs> oh yes the kayak that we keep in our cave wait it rings a bell i imagine it does i don't imagine you don't forget a kayak um it appears to be broken also how strong are you to p pick up a kayak oh well here's your problem there's a hole in the middle can i Oh, there's a handprint. What is this? Did we build a kayak with our grandmother? Was it a beautiful bonding moment in our lives? <laughs> At least she sleeps realistically. Give me that. That's exactly how I look wake up when I wake up as well. What's in the forbidden room? I want to know. Sounds like some funky, funky jazz, though. Mm -hmm. Whoa! Oh, you're up. I was going to do some gardening. Will you help me? Sure. What's in that room? <gasps> the keys on top. Nothing of the door. you'd be interested in. Get dressed and meet me outside. And I'm brush to... those teeth. I'm trying to think why. <gasps> Fabrice and Nora uh, would have fallen out so badly. Like, Nora, all right, maybe she's opinionated, maybe Fabrice is. But, like, what would have caused them to properly fall out as bad as they have? 
Maybe he's a racist. <laughs> Maybe he's right wing and she's left wing. Politics. It can get between people, right? Get ready to help in the garden. Can't I just find... Ooh, exciting. Okay. Oh, I got a new word. Yay. Uh, okay, apparently I don't go over here to get ready this time. I go here. I look out the window. Time does fly when you're having fun. Like when I stream. It always goes fast really quick. Wait, you said get... It's locked. Hmm. You said to get ready. Oh, brush my teeth. What is wrong with me? Why do I not listen? Uh, was this the bathroom? I forget. It was. Brush those teeth, Smithy. Are we actually going to have a brushing the teeth mini game? Excellent. This is hilarious. Well, I didn't do anything then. What, what's happening? Oh. Oh, I see. We oh, this is weird. So, you have to control the arms with each side of the mouth. Let's brush those teeth. Wait, why is... I haven't put any water on my toothbrush. This is weird. Oh, I see. <laughs> uh, okay. Give me some water. Uh, give me some water. Put it back down. Now what? <laughs> I like the way she's looking at her hands like she's never seen them before. Like, oh my god, what is this? Uh, how high are you right now? Wait, are we done? I... Turn the tap on. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> like, whoo. Oh, it was reached for the towel. That's what I was meant to be doing. Okay. Did she just die? What just happened? Oh, it wasn't a towel. It was her clothes. That was adorable, by the way. This game is sick. This I actually really like this. I almost forgot my hat. Not my signature hat. <laughs> this is actually really good. I'm done! That house. How did I feel about it? I used to come, but... But something... My father and his mother became more distant. I didn't notice it back then. I felt that something was wrong. And they never spoke about it. Is that why I don't remember that summer? But I feel like the story has already implied that the falling out happened before the summer. Not during. Oh my god, wait, wait. What if we've misjudged the situation completely? What if... Just putting this out there. Be like, really nice grandma. Like, you know, she seems quite nice anyway. Secret room. Locked room. She doesn't let you go in. Maybe she's a serial killer. Just putting it out there into, y into the ether. Just saying. Be a goddamn twist and a half, wouldn't it, if this beautiful watercolour, um, <laughs> poignant adventure tale turned into a survival horror. <laughs> That's why she has a cave. Oh my god, it's all piecing together. I wasn't sure you really wanted to help. I don't know anything about gardening. Me too, mate. Well, we'll start with something easy. Why don't you go and fetch a trowel from the cave? A trowel? Ah, oh, don't worry. It's like a small shovel. You can't miss it. Uh, if you say so. Oh! Uh, that tape. I see the tape. Yeah. There's the trowel. Is there anything else in here that we can nab before I pick up the trowel? Oh, oh, oh. What was that? Mysterious. Collected ourselves another word. Travel. You've collected the trowel. Grandma was right. It looks like a small shovel. I mean, it 
Oh. Hey, you got a new sticker. Wow, a kayak. Cool. Mimi, did you find the trowel? Yes, coming. I got the trowel. I got the pieces. You took your timer, you are. Please, I did that in seconds. You have a kayak. Yes, it belonged your, to your dad, but it's broken. Oh no, I wish I could go kayaking. Well, let's concentrate on gardening today, all right? I need you to pull out the weeds. Yeah, yeah. I would not suggest kayaking with a with a broken kayak, my friend. Oh, we're gonna actually pull out the weeds. God's sake, I have to do gardening in real life. I don't want to do it now. This is an accurate representation of how I take my weeds out. Ah! <laughs> So, Dad had a kayak? Yes, he did. Your grandfather and your father used to kayak every back in the day. Oh my god. Again, we're just putting these theories out there. We're throwing them out. What if? We don't know how the grandfather died, but he was ill. The grandfather's death is what caused the grandmother and the son to drift apart for some reason. Maybe the, grand maybe the son blames the grandmother. Yes, he used... Uh, yeah, we already said that. Your, well, your father never really liked it. Okay, never mind. Fuck it. Doesn't matter. Thought they were building up to the fact that he had a nice loving relationship. <laughs> nope, never mind. <laughs> Pull it out. And this one. Rah! How did the kayak break? Your grandfather picked it up and broke it over for uh, your father's back because he was being a dick. It smashed into some rocks on a day, on a day that the... Oh, God's sake, I'm going to get it wrong. The Dodonia was really rough. Smashed. So cool. <laughs> um, people almost died, Mimi. It's not funny. So many weeds. Can we fix the kayak? I have to think about it. Ah. She's not a carpenter. I think I finished. Now, let's plant something, shall we? Really? Yes, of course. That's not where I had the yes from. First, we dig a hole using the trowel. Where's my trowel? I'm a dig this hole. I said, dig. Dig, 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 dig. <laughs> dig, 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 dig. I, I already did. The hole has been dug. I do not need to dig the hole. Oh, okay, maybe I do. Wait. God, what are we planting? Then choose a plant. Oh. Which one do you fancy? Rose, sage, or thyme? Roses are pretty. Thyme is nice. I, I, uh, mm, mm. We'll go rose. We'll go rose. August is the best time for planting. I, I don't know what that means. I don't know what month it is. Thyme is great for cooking and for herbal teas. You can't go wrong with thyme. Okay. And what does sage say? Sage is a favourite of mine. Perfect into my... You know what? If it's a favourite of yours, grandmother, go with the sage. Yeah. Make me some tomato sauce. Remove the pot. Whoop. Oh, my. It's naked. Uh, now we fill the hole with soil and make a little mountain to keep the plant stable. Uh, oh. Look at me, I'm a gardener. We pee. This is already more gardening than I actually do in my real garden. I'm good at killing things, if that counts as gardening. To grow, a plant needs the sun, time, and water. Exactly. When you plant something, you need to, uh, to water it a lot. Oh, look at this fat. Look at this conveniently placed. Uh, I don't know what this is. A drum of water? A barrel of water? Water the plant. Uh, I'm trying, but it out uh, because I'm pressing the wrong button. Nothing is happening. How did that work? Did I just did I mess that up? I did, I completely messed that up, didn't I? I like the war. I like the water physics effects in this game. So why? Right, so here, nothing's coming out. How do I know? What's, why is that? Why is there a bar on the bottom of the screen now? What am I doing wrong? Oh my God, what is happening? I feel like I'm doing something really wrong, and I don't understand what. 
what what to hear what to hear what why is the bar on the bottom it's confusing me how am I doing this wrong <laughs> what is happening <laughs> Oh, like this, like this, no, cause, what am I, this is not my greatest moment here on YouTube, I'll, I'll be honest. Nothing's coming out of the watering can. Do I feel stupid? Yes. Uh, yes, I fucking do. Oh. Mm. Damn it! This is legitimately the most finicky puzzle that we've had so far in this game. I do not care for it. Oh, man. Uh, so, like... Huh. Yes! God, I did not like that one. <laughs> Excellent work. I was thinking I need to get some things from the market, and there, we could buy things to fix the kayak. What do you think? Yeah, I mean, is it fixable? It is not. <laughs> It has a giant hole in it. It's in half, actually. Oh, yes. We would need a certain kind of glue. I think you need more than a goddamn piece of, bit of glue. It's in two pieces. <laughs> Maybe some wood to fix the holes. Hmm. Can we really do it? No. <laughs> yes, we can. Yeah. So what are we waiting for? <laughs> Let's become carpenters. Uh, wait, are we just following... Our grandmother. Wait, come back. Well, how did you get so far? <laughs> we walked together. What a journey it was. I mean, you're lying because you didn't walk together. Because <laughs> grandmother has fucking left you behind. Nora spoke about her life, about her travels. There was always a part of her that belonged somewhere else. I liked her. I can say it now. I loved that woman. So, so you got damn shut. So charming. Oh, she went and yes, sometimes her eyes looked sad. Oh. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Sometimes her eyes looked sad. Yay! <laughs> that was poor timing. Dad used to say that I looked just like Nora when I was daydreaming. He hated that, of course. He disliked his mother and. Never explained why. I swear, if we get through... I mean, we're not going to get through this entire game today because this is just first impressions where we just play like the beginning of the game. But I like this game so much I will be playing it in my own time. I swear, if we get to the end and we don't understand, uh, find out what the issue was between the family members, I'm going to be pissed. It's so pretty, this game. It's insane. Oh, what's this? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, we've lost our grandmother. Bollocks. I legit actually have no idea where she went. Oh. Did, did we go the right way? Or are we just lost in some random French town? I can't get over how good this game looks. It's actually insane. How did they even make it? I really would love to see like 
a documentary on the creation and how they made this game. It's really interesting to me. <laughs> oh, are we doing a diary entry or whatever it's called, journal thing? You unlock a new location, the market. And a new sticker! Welcome to the market, my dear. So many people, it's crazy. Uh, don't you live in Paris? <laughs> like, pretty sure you've seen more people than this. I told you before, we don't say crazy. But yes, it's crowded. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, the word crazy is a, uh, is a no-no word. Wonder why. Here, I wrote down what I what we need to buy. Would you like to take care of that? Oh, uh, wee oui, wee, oui, madame. Give me some, f what, it'd be francs back then, right? But mum never lets me shop by myself. She says it's too cheap. Yes, because there's a difference between this small village and Paris. I trust you, you're 12. I won't be far away. I'm just going to say hello to some old friends. Cool, I'll be back with everything. Did she give me any money? Am I just going to procure these items through my charm? I love the perspective changes in this game. It's really impressive. Ah, oh, we need a baguette. Some glue, some wood, some rhubarb, some tomato seeds, and some milk. So I'm assuming that we use the glue and the baguette to repair the <laughs> to repair the kayak. Uh, well, oh, here, here. Uh. Ah, bonjour, monsieur. Um, do you have a un baguette? <laughs> he has cheese, butter, but no milk. Well, you're useless to me. Do you have any milk? I should have some right here. Oh, it's gone. Must have been that damned kid. Which kid? There's a thief around here and he keeps whistling. It's driving everyone mad. How odd. Poor you. Life lesson for you, any of you out there. If you, um, if you ever come across someone stealing, if you ever see someone stealing food, you did not see someone stealing food. Okay. Right, where's the next one? Why can't I get there? There is an invisible force field stopping me. Okay, we will come back to you. Can we go through the crowd? Is that like, allowed? Oh, we can. We just go super slow. Hello, old lady. Wait, so the milk has been crossed off. Can we just find the kid? The whistling child? Hello. Good morning. Hello, sweetie. What can I do for you? We need tomato seeds and... I don't suppose you've got any rhubarb. You're Nora's granddaughter, aren't you? Yes, I am. So nice to meet you. I think these are the seeds she wants. Thank you so much. Success. Okay. Nailed it. Absolutely nailed it. Anything down here? Oh, oh, thing I want. Did I get it? Yeah. God, I'm loading up on the stickers and the phrases. All right, where were the other things? Was that one down here? Uh, over here, I think. Ha ha, bonjour. Good morning, I need some rhubarb. But I'm not sure. <laughs> I need rhubarb. Also, what is rhubarb? Those branches over there. Is it for a pie or jam? I don't fucking know, lady. Just give me the goddamn rhubarb. What difference does it make? Ah, ah, a, a very, um, a very, uh, clever, um, stall owner. Oh, which rhubarb do you need? You don't know? Why not have both? <laughs> you best take the green and red ones. Don't let them sit around, Dot, for too long before you eat them. Anything else? Nope, that's it. Have a great day, little lady. Okay. Oh, okay. I am a task hunting machine. Right, the other one was over here, wasn't it? And I didn't know where I was going. Right, there. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. There's something next to these statues of ducks. Oh, it's adorable. Oh, is this a tape? I will just steal this from your table. Thank you. Now I'm running away. Running away. Toodle. Ooh. Hello. Oh, well, do you have... Hello, sir. Do you have some wood? My grandma 
and I some waterproof glue and also some pieces of wood. We're fixing a kayak. Oh, I'm sorry. Why has he, why has he got such a frowny face? Oh, I'm sorry. You're too late. The last tube I had was pilfered a few minutes ago. Was it by someone who was whistling? What is this person doing with wood and glue? Oh my god, don't get them mixed up. Wood and glue, milk and glue. P -p -p Pilfered? Yes, stolen. I'm sure it's that little rascal. A kid your age. A right little pest, if you ask me. Okay, thank you. Why would you why would you ever speak to a, a child like that? Oh, 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 oh. Another word. Did I miss it? Calm, calm. Come back, calm. Okay, okay. Uh, right, we saw you. Was there any? There must have been someone else. No. Nope. Oh, damn it. They don't stay up long enough for me to... No! Right, down here. Around the corner. There was another one over here somewhere. I just saw pop up. Oh, my man! What? Hello? Children? Are you are one of you the thief? Crowd. Uh, there appeared to be a stall over here, and I see nothing! Kitties. Up the stairs? Perhaps? If that's possible. Aha! Ah, wee oui, wee, oui, ah, uh, bonjour, monsieur baguette. Uh, did he? I saw no transaction. He just gave us the bread, right? You saw that, right? That does look like a good baguette. So. No milk, no glue. Ah! I should go back to Grandma. Can't we fight crime and find the thief? So, no wood, no glue. I mean, I don't know why I'm surprised. The kayak in the present wasn't fixed. So, of course, we weren't going to be able to fix it. Still, though, I wouldn't mind trying to find the thief and being like, Bruh, why are you making all, why are you making all the uh, PVA glue? You can get some milk elsewhere, or glue, or wood. Oh, Mimi. Some kid stole everything. A kid? Maybe he's still here. Whoa, look how pissed she is. Damn. What do you know about our little thief? He, uh, he likes to whistle, and he's about my age. Oh my god, she literally- Grandma is Batman. Jesus. I need to take a picture of him. Don't think that'd fly these days. I'm going to take a picture of this child. Quick, Mimi. Where am I looking? Oh, where? Where? Whistling child. Just- Oh, 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 oh. Is he in the sky? Is it you? Oh. What's happening? Oh, what? oh, I don't know who I'm looking for. How on earth am I meant to know? I think it's you. There's no way. Oh, oh God, he's fast. Oh, it's like a horror movie. Right, he's coming around this way. There he is. Damn it, he's goddamn he's fast. Shit, how have I lost sight of him? Fucking hell. Come on, come on, come on, come on. He's not running now. Where's he got? Damn it! Thief child! Ah! He's gone the other way. This is so ex Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? God's sake, where is he? God, this is difficult. Oh my god, this is so hard. My eyes are going cross-eyed. Oh, where are you, little brat? You cannot escape, just as... No! Feck. Let me try again. Oof. 
Where are you, thief child? Right, let's... Oh my god, my eyes! Right, right. Oh, oh, oh! Does that count? Yes! I got his forehead! <laughs> now everyone will know. It's this random forehead of this child. The thief. He dropped his bag. Oh. I feel bad that we took his milk though. Everything like. he stole is in it. Funny. Now that I think about it, it's like she knew who the thief was. Why don't you take back all the stolen stuff? I'm sure the sellers will be pleased. Good idea. Thank you, Mimi. Well done, Mimi. Let's go. Oh, look at that now. adorable little dog. I remember now how good it felt, helping other people, giving up my time for them. How come I'd forgotten all that? It's a good question. Trauma. When you found out your uh, grandmother was a murderer. <laughs> and that one? Are we staring at the stars? That's not a star. Look how fast it's moving. It's a satellite, stupid child. <laughs> wow. And the big blue star over there? Ah, that's Sirius. The brightest star we could see, just like you. Oh, shucks, Grandmama. I'm not a star. Almost. Tell me, how was it today? How do you feel? Ooh. Awesome! Today was awesome, but tomorrow we'll fix the kayak, and I can't wait. I don't blame you. Garden. Kayak. Uh, let's say garden. It was nice to work in the garden with you. Your help was very much appreciated, young lady. Thief market traders. Um, I do want to know more about the thief. So glad we managed to stop that thief. You and your camera, you're like a proper reporter. I am like a proper reporter, it is correct. So, the first half of your holiday is over. I'm sure the second half will be even better. I know it will. What's wrong, Mimi? Are you worried about something? No, no, just... Thinking about the thief. I wonder if he was forced to steal or if it was just a game. I, I, I think it was forced. Ah, well, that's another mystery to solve for Mimi, the brilliant reporter. I'm not a reporter. That binder of yours is like a newspaper, right? Mm, okay, maybe you're right. <laughs> I am a reporter. By the way, time to do my page. It's time for a journal entry. Uh, this is the only photo I took of his, <laughs> of his forehead. Um, let's go with this. Can we stick it on here? No, I don't want to do that. Let's stick it there. And we will go with unfamiliar calm. I welcome everything awesome. I want to shout out awesome. This is, this is my poem for the day. Unfamiliar calm. I want to shout out awesome. Gotcha. God, I'm a literary genius. That'll do. Memory over. This has been a really, really fun game. I've really enjoyed this. I'm not gonna lie. That is not the picture I took of that child. <laughs> At all. And we're back in the present. Whoosh. Chapter 4. Top of the world. Well, i tell you what, everybody. I think it's uh, this seems like a really good place to leave it. If you have enjoyed this stream, then please like, share, and subscribe to the channel for all the indie gaming content you could possibly need. We don't just look at um, watercolor adventures. We look at all sorts of different indie games. Um, but yeah, if you if you've liked this stream in particular, then please let me know in the comments uh, if you'd like to see more. If you want to see me complete the game, even if you want to get to the end of this mystery, then do let me know. But until next time, I hope every one of you has an amazing day, and I will catch you very soon. Take care. See y'all. Bye.